You scared them off anyway. I Imagine stumbling upon a secret so terrifying, it shakes the very foundation of our understanding of ancient civilizations. Welcome to Egypt, a land shrouded in mysteries and secrets that have shocked scientists and archaeologists for centuries. But what if some secrets were meant to remain buried? Today we unravel the chilling discoveries that not only puzzle the mind, but also send shivers down the spine. From mummies with golden tongues to the dark pit of severed giant hands, the unseen realms of this ancient civilization unfold before our eyes, revealing tales of power, betrayal, and otherworldly phenomena. Join us as we explore the sands of time, unveiling the ten most terrifying discoveries in Egypt that promise to alter everything we thought we knew. The Labyrinth of Hawara Stepping away from the surface and into the depths of Egypt's ancient mysteries, we encounter our tenth discovery, the Labyrinth of Hawara. Hidden deep within the desert, this perplexing structure, often referred to as the Black Pyramid of Dashur, stands as an illustration of the architectural prowess of Pharaoh Amenemhat III from the 12th dynasty. Standing at 75 meters, the labyrinth of Hawara's limestone exterior invites exploration. Discovered in 2008, its underground chambers captivate visitors. Greek historian Herodotus wrote of its maze-like design in the 5th century. The labyrinth has two chambers, one eastern for the king, adorned with a symbolic pink granite casket, and a southern for queens, shimmering with jewelry and sarcophagi. While inscriptions provide clues, much of the labyrinth's depths remain a tantalizing enigma. Golden-Tongued Mummies From the enigmatic depths of the labyrinth of Hawara, we now shift our gaze to a discovery that's as intriguing as it is haunting, the Golden-Tongued Mummies. In February 2021, at the Taposiris Magna Temple in Alexandria, archaeologists unearthed tombs holding mummies from the Greco-Roman era. These weren't just regular mummies that we all know of. These are distinguished by terrifying golden tongues. But the surprises weren't over. By December, at the Oxyrhynchus site near El Banasa, a similar burial revealed a man adorned with gold foil tongues, an exquisite rarity. Among the treasures unearthed, three caskets stood out. Though grave robbers had robbed two, one remained intact. It revealed two bodies, and the signature golden tongue encased in a grand limestone coffin. But why this gold fascination? Ancient Egyptians believed that in the afterlife, a golden tongue would grant the departed the voice to converse with Osiris, the lord of the underworld ensuring safe passage to eternity. Ongoing excavations at the Kiesner site, spanning over 25 years, hint at more buried wonders, promising to deepen our insight into Egypt's captivating customs. Khafra's Diorite Statue At the heart of Cairo's Grand Egyptian Museum rests a majestic artifact, the Khafra's Diorite Statue, an embodiment of ancient mastery and timeless grandeur. Unearthed in 1860, CE by August Mariette, the statue of Pharaoh Khafre, carved from Northcote, Nice, lay concealed beneath his valley temple. Representing the fourth dynasty ruler seated on a lion-pawed throne, its intense gaze peers seemingly through time, while symbols like the Wadjet Cobra and an embracing Horus Falcon provide divine protection and connection. Though each detail, from hieroglyphs to craftsmanship, exemplifies ancient Egypt's splendor, it's Khafre's lifelike stare that notably bridges the divine and the living in Egyptian belief, standing not just as an artifact, but as a lingering reminder of Egypt's deep history and legacy. The Screaming Mummy Venturing deeper into the mysterious Egyptian land, we find ourselves amidst the haunting silence of Egypt's Deir el-Bahari tomb complex, gazing upon a mummy unlike any other, the Screaming Mummy. 
Imagine unearthing a corpse, its mouth agape in an eternal scream. Identity obscured by the sands of time. That was the fate of Prince Pentawir, son of Pharaoh Ramses III, unveiled through meticulous DNA analysis. This wasn't a noble death either. The harem conspiracy papyrus narrates a tale of familial betrayal, where Pentaware orchestrated a plot to murder his own father. But things didn't go as planned. Trials were held, overseen by staunchly loyal butlers, and culprits faced execution or mutilation. As for Pentaware, the mystery shrouding his death, whether by hanging, poisoning, or a blend of both, perpetually intertwines with his identity. Revealing a startling departure from royal mummification norms, his body was unceremoniously swathed in sheepskin, viewed as impure in ancient Egypt, rather than laid in a sarcophagus. But does this mummification style hint at the success of the harem conspiracy? A 2012 computed tomography scan of Ramses III hints at foul play, revealing marks on his throat, leaving us to ponder the success of Pentaware's diabolical plot amidst his eternal silent scream. Pit of Giant Hands While Egypt's enchanting relics consistently mesmerize us, sometimes they chill us to the bone. In the ancient city of Avaris in 2011, archaeologists unearthed a discovery that sent shivers down their spines. Four pits containing 16 dismembered right hands, dating back roughly 3600 years and hidden near the majestic palace of King Kian of the Hyksos dynasty, these oversized hands tell a tale more terrifying than fiction. Two pits lay close to the grand throne room, the others outside the palace, but why? The hands, it seems, might be the world's earliest evidence of an unsettling war tradition. Victorious soldiers, it speculated, would sever their defeated enemies' right hands, exchanging them later for gold as a symbol of their fearlessness. These trophies of triumph were then laid to rest in the palace pits, painting a haunting portrait of ancient warfare rites and the Hyksos era's terrifying realities. Lost Golden City Known today as the Lost Golden City and hidden for over three millennia, a city once lost to time has been reborn. Discovered after countless millennia and painstaking excavations, its vast streets and relics offer a vivid journey back to Egypt's fourth dynasty. Egyptologist Zahi Hawass, a beacon in the field, suggests its significance might compete with even the iconic reveal of Tutankhamun's tomb. Indeed, as layers of dust are swept away, treasures related to Queen Tai, the wife of the enigmatic Amenhotep III, emerge. These artifacts set amidst the sprawling ruins whisper tales of the young pharaoh Tutankhamun drawing both scholars and historians into a whirlwind of anticipation and curiosity about the interlinked tales of life, death, and royalty in ancient Egypt. The Tomb of the Unknown Queen If you thought this journey into the Egyptian discoveries couldn't get any more terrifying, then hold on to that thought. In the ancient Egyptian soil, a tomb, lush and golden, cradles the remains of a queen unknown. The discovery, shrouded in mystery, unearthed not only the royal chamber but also an astonishing ensemble of 300 coffins housing everyone from Tutankhamun's respected generals to sage advisors all enclosed in cases artfully detailed with scenes from the Book of the Dead. Among the treasures and shafts, artifacts from ancient games and figurines colloquially named Shaptis lay dormant alongside a mummified soldier his hand forever clasped around a metallic axe. The opulence of the queen's solid gold tomb stunned even experienced archaeologists, and despite the designation as Royal Queen Neith, her true identity still remains unclear. Speculations buzz around her possible divinity, connecting her to the goddess of creation or perhaps the mother of Ra, the sun god adding an additional layer of intriguing uncertainty to a history waiting to be fully unveiled. The Rosetta Stone A group of soldiers, amidst Napoleon Bonaparte's vigorous campaign in 1799, stumbled upon an artifact that bridged two different eras, the Rosetta Stone. 
Discovered 35 miles east of the animated city of Alexandria, this black basalt marvel, nearly four feet in length and about two and a half feet in width, enchanted scholars and historians with its inscriptions in three languages, Greek, Egyptian hieroglyphics, and Egyptian demotic. Surprisingly, at this juncture, only Greek was comprehensible. This left a veiled ancient Egypt, its stories and knowledge out of reach. The enigma encased within the hieroglyphics posed a terrifying reflection on the volumes of lost history until scholars like Thomas Young and Jean-Francois Champollion painstakingly deciphered them, utilizing the Greek as a linguistic key and gradually unlocking the secrets that ancient Egypt had safe guarded for millennia. Lion cub mummies, the second terrifying discovery of our journey today takes us to ancient Saqqara, located just south of Cairo. Archaeologists in late 2019 found the remains of lion cubs mummified, their bodies enveloped in ancient linen. Amidst a vast sea of artifacts and mummified animals, from majestic bulls and falcons to mythical serpents and scarab beetles, the lion cubs uniquely showcased a blend of majesty and mystery. Their preserved youth, showcased through computed tomography scans, revealed distinct size and bone structure, hinting at the cultural practice of mummifying young, perhaps even infant, animals. Though hidden under the impenetrable layers of time, these mummies silently speak to ancient religious practices, wherein they may have been offered to the gods or even revered as deities themselves. The delicate process of their mummification, particularly of such youthful creatures, unfolds an unsettling image, intertwining the spectacle of life, death, and belief. Meteorite Rock from Protoplanet In the scorching Sahara Desert, a meteorite quietly revealed its awe-striking secrets in May 2020, capturing the attention and imagination of stargazers and scientists alike. Named EC002, this 4.56 billion years old ancient rock doesn't merely hail from the distant past, but astonishingly predates Earth itself. Its form, molten rock solidified over a 10,000-year cooling period, reaching searing temperatures up to 1,222 degrees Celsius, silently witnessed the earliest moments of our solar system. Originating from a protoplanet, a celestial entity on its way to becoming a planet, Kino 2 isn't simply a meteorite, but a tangibly snippet from a time and place in our universe we can hardly comprehend. This coarse-grained, tan-beige surface, uniquely speckled with greenish-yellow crystals, whispers tales of ancient magma and interstellar travel, leading to an unsettling realization. The vast universe has been quietly interacting with our planet for millennia. As our journey comes to an end, Egypt's ancient secrets from buried cities to meteorites older than our planet reveal a world beyond our imagination. While we uncover these treasures, one can't help but wonder, what other mysteries does this age-old land still hold, waiting to be rediscovered? Only time will tell.